Hey guys, you already know, time for another direct upload. I feel like this busy street is very loud. So um, let me just walk a little bit before we get into the video because I'm not sure if you can hear me or not. It was like sirens and stuff and police and ambulances riding. So anyway, um, you know, uh, guys, I go, I have these moments when I just do a bunch of videos based on a certain subject matter and then I move on to another subject matter. So this subject matter is going to be for Kevin Burrell again. Um, I got a proposition for you, Mr. Kevin Burrell. Um, I, I would like to help you, okay? I, look, I'm not trying to get with Kevin Burrell. He's a nice guy, but he's gay. Um, hey, baby. Okay, he's a nice guy, but he's gay. And, you know, I'm, it's nothing. I'm not trying to be romantic with Mr. Kevin Burrell. I, I'm with Anderson. I'm not, you know, trying to trying to um, get romantic with Kevin. I'm not trying to get romantic with Kevin. Okay, just for in case people think the wrong thing, okay? Anyway, Kevin is a nice guy. He's in the skincare industry, and he's, he's just a nice guy, and I want to help him because, honestly, people don't realize that religion does a lot of harm to them, and I hate to see um, good people get hurt. I hate to see people suffer. And if I could just get it through his head, you know, Kevin, I've been there. I've had anxiety before, baby. I've had it before. I'm over it. I don't have it anymore. I've been religious before, Kevin. I know what that does to someone's head, please. I, if you don't listen to me, you're never gonna heal up. You're never gonna heal up. I don't know why you're so adamant about this invisible world that you are clinging on to. Religion is based on the invisible realms. It's invisible. So anyway, I'm screaming. I just, you know, I know what that does to people. It just harms them. So I just want to try to help you out so that you're not, you know, fucked up every single day. You know, I'm sorry, sir, for you're screaming. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I don't, I, you know, I'm not trying to um, upset nobody else. Let me stop screaming because the street is quiet here. As you can see, there's no cars. This gentleman just walked past me laughing. Uh, so, let me tell you something. I got a proposition for you, Mr. Kevin Burrell. I get very emotional about people being hurt by religion. I get very upset. Um, I'm the... I'm the annoyed atheist for a goddamn reason. I'm annoyed with religion because it hurts people. And when you try to help them, so you try to help them get out of this hurt. You try to help them to get out of the mental illness. You try to help, help them, try to help them to get out of this religious world that's actually the world that's fucking them up. But they're too blind to see it because they've been, they're under the God deception. Kevin, if you don't try to wake up, I guarantee you, you're going to die like that, depressed and with anxiety. And like I said last night, if it wasn't for your mom, you would be fucking homeless, living in New York in a cardboard box or under a goddamn bridge somewhere, okay? So I got a prep proposition for you, Mr. Kevin Burrell. I got a show idea for you. I got a idea for a um for a youtube um little series of videos and we can title this little series where we go back and forth with each other and we talk to each other on the fucking youtube just like old times when youtube used to be where it was like a social meeting where people could record responses and post them underneath people's videos and you know we can I could talk to you, Kevin. You could talk to me. And we can talk to each other. And we can try to work this out. 
with you trying to I'm just trying to get you out of the dumps I'm trying to bring you out of your um, mental illness I'm trying to bring you out of the darkness into the light I'm trying to do this with love for humanity I don't know you to tell you that I love you but I do feel that I feel very bad for you when I see you with your so much pain and hurting your eyes and you are only doing it to yourself because you refuse to let go of the Bible book that's fucking you up and making you have mental illness. So what my proposition is, I would like to do a little um, YouTube series called Atheist versus Christian. I would like for you to present why you love Christianity. I would like for you to present why you are clinging on to Christianity so um, tightly. I would like for you to present, you know, why you are, I mean, if we could just, you can come up with a subject matter topic. You can say what's going on in your life based on Christianity. And I can talk to you from an atheist point of view. You need to open up your mind, be a little bit more open-minded to what somebody is trying to tell you, okay? I don't have anxiety, baby, you do. I'm an atheist, you're not, okay? Who in the fuck is walking around freely and happily? Me. Who in the fuck is sitting around moping in the couch and on the fucking bed? You. Who in the fuck is the religious one? You. Who in the fuck is the atheist one? Me. Okay? Who? In, what am I doing? Walking. I got DMV problems, but I'm, I'm happy. I went shopping, had some good fucking times, had a good meal. I'm out here doing shit, Kevin. You're not doing anything. You're sitting on your sofa. You're sitting in your bed. You're talking about and complaining about all the shit that's going on in your life, uh, the depression and the anxiety, then you start bringing up Jesus Christ. He's the one that's fucking you up, Kevin Burrell. This, uh, this neighborhood is very quiet right now, so I gotta stop screaming. But I am the annoyed atheist. I am the annoyed atheist. I am the annoyed atheist, okay? I am annoyed for a goddamn reason. I get annoyed when religion hurts people. I it, I actually take it personal because I've done been through it. I done been through the hurt. I done been through the pain. I done been through the confusion. I done been through the anxiety. Take it from a bitch like me. I done survived it, okay? So anyway, Kevin, listen, if you wanna make it some interesting topics, the, um, the atheist crew, would like to probably um, hear us go back and forth with each other in a kind, considerate way. If I start screaming and getting upset because I am the annoyed atheist, don't you ever forget that, okay? If I start screaming and being really harsh and being very um, blasphemous and very mean-spirited towards religion, it's because I see what it's doing to you and I'm trying so hard to help you, but at some point I'm just gonna say, you know what, Kevin, drop dead. Uh, you're not gonna, you're not gonna go to heaven. You're gonna die. You're gonna die. You're gonna die, and all that misery, and all that anxiety, and all that depression. Okay? You're gonna. I'm talking. You might live to be a hundred, but you're gonna go through so much pain and suffering daily. You're gonna be going through pain and suffering. All because you want to keep on playing with that fucking Bible book. So, you know, at some point, you got to just let people do what they're going to do. And I'm letting you do what you got to do. I'm just saying, I think it would be a good show idea. You know, give some atheist people a little bit of extra content. Um, they got the Atheist Republic. They got Atheism is Unstoppable. They got the Unstoppable Atheist. They got all different people from all different points of views of atheism to watch but I think that um so we know what happens we know see we know we know we know what happens to 
people, religious people, they're mentally ill, okay? We know what happens. You turn mentally ill, could happen to anybody. Could happen to this person next door, could happen to any fucking body. Could happen to your mom, could happen to your grandma, could happen at any stage of somebody's life. They could go nuts playing with a Bible book. Okay, so anyway, uh, Kevin, yeah. And the, what I would like to do, I want to talk to you. You can talk to me, um, you know, and you could do a whole little series, whole little series called Atheist versus Christian. Atheist versus Christian. And we could have some really cool topics and don't worry about the fucking numbers on your YouTube videos. Don't give a fuck. They're, they're fucking you over. They're just stepping on your channel and they're not showing you your real numbers so don't even give a fuck about it don't even give a fuck about it here's my friend he's home here's his dog Nisha I didn't try to be friends with this fucking dog so many times I tried to buy her pig ears I've tried to buy her rawhide she just never wanted to like me here she is Nisha 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 hi Nisha she ain't she ain't trying to hear it. She ain't oh there's Callie. Callie wants something to eat. Callie thick. Callie. Callie. I'll I'll be back, Callie. Here's my haunted house. Um, here's the haunted house. Okay. Callie, what you doing? I'll bring you some food in just a minute, okay? I'll I'll be right back. Okay. Let me give Callie something to eat. Um, hold on. Okay, guys, um, live fiercely, love viciously, and remember, atheism is unstoppable. Say bye to my haunted house. Say bye to Callie. Say bye to Nisha. Okay, bye, guys.